Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another video. Both myself and Sarah are on to the NEC. It's We're actually, huge. It's massive here, absolutely massive. And my first, feet hurt already. First time we've ever been here, so uh, we'll get a look around uh, all the stalls as much as we can because we're only here for the one day. So uh, we'll get around, we'll look at all the stalls and we'll get you involved as well. So myself, both myself and Sarah are walking along these uh, escalators uh, into the NEC. We're following everyone else, we just hope we're going the right way because uh, at the moment everyone just seems to be going in the same direction. Airport. Trains, airport. So we might have already gone in the wrong direction. Okay, so we just found out we are going in the right direction where apparently the caravan and motorhome show is actually at halls one and five. So we are going in the right direction, aren't we, sir? Yes. Hello, everyone. Right, we're at the NEC. We're actually in uh, the Coachman area at the moment. We're actually walking around a Coachman Lusso. Uh, this actually uh, has got a, um, it's actually got a transverse bed, uh, which is on the opposite side. It's normally on the right side as you walk in the caravan, but this one is actually on the left side. Never seen one like that before. But uh, yeah, it really is nice. A um, bit overwhelmed at the moment by the amount of stuff that uh, there is to look at. So we're gonna keep looking round and uh, keep bringing you in now and again. But uh, really and truthfully, there's just so much to see. Um, it probably would have taken at least a couple of more days to see it all, don't you think, Sarah? We really would have done. So I'll come back to you in a sec. That's a similar yeah, to so, that other one, but this is a little bit smaller. Yeah, this is, um, this isn't a, this is still an eight foot wide caravan. This has um, got more of a darker color to it. I can't, what's the name on this one, Sarah? Let's just go outside, we'll have a look. This is a laser 575. Um, really nice. Um, do like the colors in this one. It's got that sort of, um, what they call this marble effect yeah. on the walls uh, in the kitchen area. Beautiful colors for the front room. Um, really is nice. Uh, end washroom. What's the end washroom like, Sarah? So, lovely shower, sink. I don't like them sinks. I really don't like them sinks. I wish they'd try and get themselves away from it, Coachman. But, you know, it just seems to be if you want to just splash water on your face, these aren't the sinks to do it in because you end up hitting your uh, forearms in the, in the walls. Hello. So, anyway, onwards and upwards. So we're outside the Bailey Phoenix Plus, um, beautiful caravan. Um, the only thing with this, and I think Dan Trudgeon brought it up once, um, is that the PowerPoint is the only thing over this side of the caravan. All the other services are on the other side. This is, like I say, the Phoenix, this is a 640. We'll have a quick look inside. And uh, it is really nice. The windows, what's wrong with the windows, Sarah? What, the, oh, that's that, yeah, panoramic window um lovely shower you've obviously got the uh, wheel arch in there cool. but uh no shower i wonder if someone it, uh, yeah no they take the showers oh, out obviously so no one takes them. steals them yeah that's terrible but uh yeah oh, this is a nice caravan it's a bit narrow for... yeah well you've got toilet on the right side which is good um and the bed is in the day configuration at the moment quite nice quite nice so Sarah and myself we're actually going to take walk around the awnings um, I've not really looked at an awning exhibition before so thought we'd have a quick look around it and just see what there is available not that we're going to buy one um, because uh, our one is perfectly serviceable I think What's don't you that? think so our awning yes perfect for what it is you know so no reason to change it but they are nice to look at so we'll have a look around so yeah yeah, so this is Swift, yeah. Right, so we're having a look around the uh, Swift uh, Sunrise transverse bed. Just follow Sarah in. What lovely colours. It no, it's lovely colours though, Sarah. You know, yeah, yeah, three rings. Why do they only put three rings in? I mean, they've done away with the electric hull, which yeah, not to me, all of them, they haven't. yeah, I know, but I know this is quite a cheap caravan it's only about just over 24,000 but yeah it is cheap um transverse bed in the day configuration 
So you have got quite a bit of room to move and over around. What's the um, bathroom like, Sarah, and the shower? Can I ask you what the TV dish you from? YouTube. Oh, YouTube. we're not, yeah, we're not. No, we've had, we've had uh, Channel 5 down earlier. Have Call you? me Sarah, Caravan Life. <laughs> but watch it, watch it, because I'm quite funny in it. Are you? <laughs> Do you need an agent? No. <laughs> yeah. Do you need a caravan? We are, well, we're, we're looking. looking. Sarah and myself, we found this um, uh, caravan, um, Wingham, I'm sure that's how you say it, Wingham Rookie 3.5. Now, it is one massive shell. There's no bonding on it. It is just one big massive shell. And they give you a massive seven year warranty. And all I can see is the parts that it would ever leak on is around the windows and possibly where the heater is um, and where any fixtures go. But it is really weird. I'm going to take a look inside. Let's take a look inside, Sarah. These hinges on the door are absolutely mad. They're massive, aren't they? Hang on, Sarah, let me just get in so I can just see what you're doing. But I don't think you could spend more than a weekend in here. I mean, look, it's big enough. Yeah. I got me on my own. Yeah, I think, I think, I think if, yeah, I mean, if a you was weekend. to, yeah, I think you wouldn't want to do much more than a long weekend. Um, I may be wrong, or Sarah may be wrong, but it certainly is. What's in that room there, Sarah? That one there. Probably like a wardrobe. Is it? Yeah, it's like a wardrobe. That's it is a massive clothes. wardrobe. <laughs> I don't know where yeah. My yeah, yeah. Um, but anyway, it's mad, absolutely mad. I've never seen anything like it in all my life. But uh, yeah, quite, you, quite sweet, quite compact. Yeah, I mean, you really would have to be very, very limit. You take, you know, minimum amount of clothes and stuff. But <clears throat> yeah, not like me then. No. So Sarah and myself, we decided to take a walk around the edge actually, because there seems to be a lot more going on around the edge. Um, a lot of people at the moment are just taking a look at the actual um, caravans and motorhomes. So we wanted to get away from all that. Um, but there is some lovely stuff here to see. It's really overwhelming, the amount of stuff. Um, but yeah, we've um, just been and spoken to some guy about some cleaner to use on the caravan. Um, because we've got that dull mark above the front windows, I want to try and get rid of that. So I'm going to go back and see him later on. Look in this one, this is the Swift Finesse uh, by What's the name of the company, Sarah? Sorry? What's the name of this company? That is, uh, I don't know, Fitness. No, it's Copeland's Caravans. So we'll take a quick look inside. Really nice, really, really nice. Um, this is an eight foot wide caravan, um, transverse bed. And, um, oh, it's a Swift. Yeah, no, the name of the company. Oh. So we'll take a quick look inside. Um, again, it's very similar to the uh, the Swifts that I've done uh, videos on already, but this is actually in the actual night configuration, and you've got plenty of room to walk around yourself, um, no problem at all. Um, I'll be honest with you, both myself and Sarah are very overwhelmed with uh, what we're seeing up here at the NEC, and um, it wouldn't surprise me if we come away with, not, with a caravan, it really wouldn't. But uh, yeah, Sarah's just standing outside. Let's have a look in this one. This is the uh, Finesse 580 Special Edition by Copeland's Caravans. Again, another lovely caravan. Really nice, love the colours they've used. And um, also, bed is in the day configuration. Again, it's an eight foot wide, so you actually can walk around and uh, fully lined shower, which is not intruded by the wheel well because it's at the back really nice hmm? no come on sir you coming no, right. <laughs> <laughs> I was just doing a bit of filming for my YouTube channel so you're fine thank you this is the finesse 590 six berth again special edition and this one I mean this really wouldn't be for us um, there'd be no need for a caravan like this at all this is seven foot wide um, they're playing music in here, so I'm not going to spend too long in here. But this is basically a um, two bunk beds, and you make up this as a double and a double in the front, so it's a six berth altogether. But this wouldn't be for us at all, it really wouldn't. But they are nice, they've used the space really well.
This is a Bascar 835, um, eight foot wide, and um, it is lovely. It is lovely. Oh, I like this. Sarah, Sarah's uh, knocking at the door. Oh, there might be someone in there. <laughs> yeah, there might be. Well, but yeah. Out, look. Again, oh. nice. Wheel arch in the shower. Wardrobe by the side of the shower. But it is a nice layout. Really nice. Really nice. Don't worry, you're fine. You'll be on my YouTube channel, so don't worry. <laughs> Toilet, Sarah, not cars. <laughs> We're still at it was still in actual hall number one i mean we uh, we yeah we are going around in circles and i think we need to move up to hall number two yes. um just to go and have a look around there but this company here broadland um they offered us a, a, a deal on a caravan we also went over to uh, raymond james which is there they also offered us a deal on a caravan so they're obviously out to do a lot of business but uh yeah it will be uh Interesting, to say the least. So we're going to make our way into hall number two. Up this way. <laughs> Getting told off by Sarah. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, we have hit the coachman area. And um, this is going to be interesting because we absolutely love coachmen. So me and Sarah are going to look in the VIP 575 coachman. This is a transverse bed. Go on, Sarah, in you go. Let's have a quick look round. Like Let's have a look round. Well, sorry, we are scooting around these quick because obviously people do want to get in here after us. But this uh, is also a transverse. Um, it's um, seven foot wide. It's not the, the eight foot. Um, but it's very, very, very similar to the one that we looked at uh, down at um, Sussex Caravan Motorhome Centre. Um, but yeah, lovely. I like these lights. They are soft touch lights, so you literally just stroke them, and they are really nice. Really, really nice. The Coachman Laser 545, eight foot wide island bed on the back wall. Um, beautiful caravan by Coachman. Again, one of my all time favourite caravans, and we do like them. We're going to get a look inside in a moment, but this gentleman's in there, so we've got to let him look round. But we'll have a quick look through the window. Uh, L shaped bedroom and you have what I can see is the toilet and shower in the middle section and then the bedroom against the back wall well they are lovely we might come back to this one because these people are going to take their time so I don't blame them uh, the only difference with this one is that the oh, sorry sir sorry the uh, bedroom is on the uh, bathroom sorry is on the left hand side so you would be putting your um, toilet cassette into your awning which is a shame there's a fully wheelchair accessible caravan there the massive door so you can get inside it really really nice that I don't think I don't think you can go inside it Sarah I don't think you're allowed inside this one but that is lovely no because um, there's a thing there but yeah I have like a motor in the floor so you can hoist people in that's really nice sorry Sarah everything is extended outwards Really nice. That's if you're in a wheelchair, but yeah. yeah, but it's good that they pay for Oh absolutely. Yeah well they've got to, haven't they? Yeah, fully fully accessible wheelchair motorhome. Oh right, okay, so you can lift them in and out yeah. and around. Yeah, that's... Yeah. But they've had to reinforce them. Yeah. Wow. I that's, think that's a good idea for... Um, yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah. Go down that way, Sarah. We've, we've just come... We've just been in the House of Tweed. There was 50% sale and she bought herself... Well, I bought her a shawl, which is really nice. Um, they're all really nice, $24.99 down to £10. And uh, that is, uh, which one did we buy you, Sarah? 
Uh, it was the grey one, isn't it? Yeah, the, yeah. So same similar pattern as these, but in grey. Um, and uh, yeah, really, really nice, good quality fabric. So yeah, that's what Sarah's got. Oh, Cheaper than a caravan, Sarah. It is. Very cheaper. <laughs>